Hey guys, it's Stephanie here. So, I um, ordered a birch box this month and I was checking online to see when it would come in and it was saying that it would come in the 15th probably and checked my mailbox today and it was there! So, I'm going to show you guys what came in it. My thoughts on it, um, this is my second birch box ever. So, um, yeah, let's get started. This is what it looks like. It comes in little package like this comes in your mail and you just open it and here it is oh that was upside down that's what it looks like let's get in there and if you don't know Birchbox is a monthly subscription surface <laughs> monthly subscription service that's ten dollars a month and you can cancel it whenever you want it just gives you beauty samples and things in my case, I wouldn't normally purchase because they're so expensive, and it kind of gives me a chance to try those products in case I wanted to buy them. So, this is what it looks like when I open it up. Hello. It's got this little card that tells you about their theme for the month. Um, this month there was a regular, which is this one. There was a Goop Birch Box, which I think came with like a nail polish and stuff, but I didn't know what I wanted. So I just didn't answer their email saying, do you want a Goop Birch Box? So I got the regular one, which kind of sucks because I kind of, I saw the products after they asked me and I was like, dang it. But okay, so what it looks like, it's, this month is Transformations. And what, it has the list of like all the things it came with and their full sizes. So it's like a good indication of like how much a birch box is worth so I'm gonna try to calculate that and let you guys know what this month's birch box is worth so let's get started okay so you open it up and then look all the goodies and I totally cheated guys I already opened this up oops um I was just so excited I had to open it up but I'm gonna show you the beauty products first and then the lifestyle extra last so came with this little um, lip butter by Mox Botanicals if you can see it um, and I when I saw this online I thought it was gonna have a tint to it which made me really excited that would be like a I don't know because the flavor is pomegranate and fig so I thought it might be pink but it's not it's just clear um, I put this on today on my lips, um, underneath a Revlon lip butter. So it does work very nicely. I thought it smells nice and it went on my lips really nicely and I like it so far. Um, I don't know if it'll be like an everyday wear thing, but we'll see. It could grow on me, but it's a very nice sample. Um, a full size. $24 and I'll check and see how much it is for a full size and this this is 0 0.1 ounce so we shall see this is city sunscreen serum it says combining powerful skincare benefits with globally approved sun protection paraben oxybenzone and fragrance free um, and it's 30 SPF and it gave you these two little foil samples, which are fine, but it's kind of annoying to like, because I know I'm not going to use this all at once, to like cut a hole in it and then squeeze a little bit out when I use it. But either way, it's really nice and sunscreen is always a good thing to have. So yeah, I'm pretty happy about that. It's nice. And a full size thing of this is 20 to $42 depending on the size. So next, they have these little packages, which are always the fun ones because they have the best things in them. At least to me, it's like surprise in a package, my birch box. Okay, so it comes in this little paper. Let's unravel it. There are two things in here. First one is a perfume sample, and it's um, Harvey Prince 
Ah, oh, flirt. I don't know if that's how you say it, but I'm going to say, ah, oh, flirt. Okay, and it says, a hint of seduction. Hmm. And it says, introducing the first perfume that flirts for you. Ah, flirt has been clinically proven to attract men with its wickedly irresistible fragrance. Heads will turn with just one whiff of this subtle yet sexy scent. And it's infused with essences of pumpkin. Fancy. So this is what it looks like. It has, it's green. I'm going to take it out. It's a little green. And oh, <laughs> let's see what it smells like. Kind of smells like candy. I don't know what I think yet. I'm going to put a little bit on my wrist. Okay, I'm going to let it sit and see how I like it. Letting it dry. So, the other thing that was in my little bag, which I'm pretty excited about, is the Marilou Manizer. Um, and it's a highlighter, shimmer, or eyeshadow. It's by the bomb. This is what it looks like. It's like a shimmery, like, nude. Yeah, that's what I would call it, shimmery nude. It's a pretty good size. It's like a good size eyeshadow. And it's really cute. This thing is a little magnetized, so it's like a little book. It's nice and it felt really cool. And I already used it on my eyes today. I don't even know if you can see it. Use it as the lid color. And I quite like it. Um, I was thinking about getting one from somewhere. I don't know. I was thinking about getting it from Elf. Elf. I, ha I just ordered a bunch of things from Elf. And it should be coming in soon. So I'll do a haul on that. Woohoo! So yeah. Oh, God. I like it. Well, that was probably my favorite thing out of the products. I also like the balm. And perfume samples are nice. So the other thing that it came with, the Lifestyle Extra, was this. The Protein Bar by Luna. And it's chocolate peanut butter. Which is nice. But my problem with this is I'm going to eat it in one sitting and it's going to be gone. <laughs> So, it is a sample, yes. And it's nice because these things are expensive. But, I'm not huge on the whole fancy food. It says, Breast Cancer Fund. And it says, Prevention Starts Here. So, that's pretty cool. It is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And, it's 12 grams of protein and gluten-free. So, it's a good option for you, those of you who are on a gluten-free diet. I have this thing on the bottom and it's talking about transformations and it has five easy transformations. One's called Brighten Up, which is using this brightener. I'm going to switch your skincare, get colorful um, from bright lipstick to eyeshadow, um, do a hair swap, just like trying different hair trends, and then using the same product you have for new uses. And that's pretty cool. I mean, it's cool. And on the side, it tells you how to use your highlighter. Um, I did it on my eyelid, on my brow bone, and my inner eye. I used a little bit on my cheekbones and my nose, and I used it on the Cupid's bow. Yay! And I'll leave a link below on how you can get yourself your own birch box. And I'm in college. I work part-time. And I was like, I don't know if it's going to be worth it. In the past two months... I've been okay. I got a nail polish last month by a Color Club, which was like the best thing in there. And I also got some other things. But anyways, I think it's a pretty good investment when I think about it. Probably stick with it, even through the disappointing months. But you should get you some. I just used 11th Gorgeous's tagline. That was stupid. I'm going to make it my own. I'm going to say, Holla. Also, I'm going to show you guys my nails. See, they're like purple and then they're like green. Purple and green. Magic. Subscribe.
like, you know, I'm new. So whatever you want to do, find me on Twitter. I don't tweet that much about beauty stuff, but I tweet funny things. And you can find me on here. So yeah. I also have another YouTube channel of me singing some songs. So I'll link that too. Because why not? Hey guys, also, um, thanks for watching. And let me know if you have any video requests or if you have any questions. Or let me know what your favorite thing from your birch box was. Or, um, yeah, talk to me. Because I'm going to read all your comments. Because why not? See ya. That was stupid. Whatever. Okay. Bye.